Since this February marks the 5th year anniversary of Automata, I figured I'd make this month's video be about the game's most prominent character, 2B. In all honesty, 2B is not my favorite character in the series. That would go to Emil or Popola. But there is something that people probably don't think about when discussing 2B, just how tragic of an existence she has. During the game's introduction, she is seen as someone who doesn't care about anything but her duties. However, this is far from how she really is. 2B is an incredibly emotional character, even showing a lot of it at the end of the first mission. In the novel A Short Story Long, the story Memory Torn recounts a mission the two of them had before the events of the game. They both explore the desert and find themselves in the Baron Temple. Yes, the same one in Replicant. It is later revealed that 9S knows Yorha's secrets and 2B is given the orders to kill 9S, an order that is not uncommon to her. The story ends with 2B almost dying to 9S, but when given the chance to kill her, 9S turns the blade on himself, because he knew the cycle the two of them must always live through, and because he wants to experience meeting 2B again. This experience traumatized 2B, promising 9S that when it's time for her to kill him again, she will not hesitate killing him. Not because of her mission as an executioner android, but because it is what 9S wanted. To grant his wish of meeting her again, and again, and again. 2B's tragedy is that she cannot live the life she wishes to have. She hates knowing that her only reason for existence is to kill 9S. We have no idea how many times 2B has experienced the loss of 9S. Throughout the course of the game, 2B slowly begins expressing herself a little more. It's fairly obvious with her remarks about thinking about how it would be nice for them to go out buying t-shirts together, and quietly calling him nines in the forest temple. But after the fight against the Dark Colossus Groon, 2B's attitude drastically changes. She is no longer just looking for her partner's black box signal, a sign of him being alive. She's looking for the only person she cares about who happens to be the person she has cursed to kill countless times, something completely out of her normal routine. Instead of trying to find him to kill, she's finding him to save. And even after the long journey of saving him and eliminating their target, she still needs to kill him. This time not because she was ordered to, but because she doesn't want him to suffer. Even in doing so, it never becomes easier always ending the same. 9S being reprogrammed into a new body that is meeting 2B for the first time again, and 2B hurt and traumatized with the memories of his execution. A little piece of me makes me think that she was happy knowing that 9S didn't upload his personal data to the bunker, but was sad once again when she found out he transferred his data to nearby machines. 2B is a living endless cycle of torment. She is both the victim and the culprit of her own actions. Punished by God? Maybe. Can she be redeemed? It's unknown. But it definitely seems like she is carrying the weight of the world. <laughs> 